Good morning, folks. It's Diamond with the Oppenheimer Ranch Project Magnetic Reversal News and Shinrin Yoku. We're bringing you a live La Palma update Tuesday, September 28th, around noontime, Mountain Time 2021. The volcano has picked up as far as output of lava, and we're going to be reporting on that for you. This is a live shot at the current uh, active vent, and you can see a massive river of lava moving rapidly down slope here. Now, I'm going to walk you through the last three volcanic ash updates starting 24 hours ago, where the eruption was sporadic and the emissions were only going to 6,000 feet. And then about 12 hours ago, that increased quite substantially. The eruption reached 17,000 feet or 5,200 meters. And the aviation color code is still orange, so they're still flying out of there. And then just moments ago, this report came out, which is why we're doing the update. There has been ongoing ash to 20,000 feet now, and that color code has since been turned red, which means they've probably shut down air traffic, and you won't hear that reported until later tonight. Now, the La Palma volcano eruption resumes with vigorous lava fountaining and fast-flowing lava flows. We have the current map. We'll get to that in just a moment. Activity resumed last night after having paused almost completely during most of the day, and a new intense phase of the eruption with voluminous lava fountains and flows is in progress now. Around 7 p.m. local time last night, they noticed intermittent explosions and ash emissions started following pulsating lava spattering from the main vent and crater. Now, on top of this, we've had some major seismic events, some of the largest in the eruption's history, kicking off in uh, just the last few hours. A 3.3 by the shore and a 3.2, uh, one up on the spine and one down here by the ocean. So we're keeping a close eye on the seismicity as the volcano increases. Now, the La Palma volcano lava flow map will give you a clear idea on, on the uptick that's happening. And this green portion, you see some extent here, and the huge extent here down towards the sea, which is here, happened just yesterday. So there has been more loss of buildings and structure and infrastructure here as it moves its way towards this old cinder cone which is the position of the large uh, earthquake that just happened moments ago. It's going to hit this high point and either go this way or this way around it. Either way, there's tons of homes stacked up on the cinder cone, so it looks like more buildings will be lost based on the current eruptive nature. And the amount of lava coming out now, this green map is yesterday, so this is clearly much further along. Uh, don't know which way it's going currently. It might split and go both ways. And then it's final flat run here across the farmlands to the sea. And here we have a scarp. So this is a huge cliff that that lava will drop off precipitously into the ocean. This is the current lava map flow. And it's just showing you uh, the 20th is red. The 25th is yellow. So that's five days different. And then the 26th is blue. And the 27th is green. So in the last two days, the lava has uh, flow has grown just as much as it has in the first five days. And we're back here live at La Palma to give you a little look of some of that activity. Now, the Stromboli and lava fountain here alone is hundreds of feet high. And you can see this massive lava river. I mean, I, I don't see any end in sight to this uh, eruption based on what we're looking at here. And we'll just give you some of the telemetry here. This is the uh, seismic tremor since the beginning of the eruption here. Green line. And you can see here, one, two, three. It seems like it's breathing. Every day it goes up and down, up and down. Cycles of the volcano. And here's a huge up and down the other day. That was the, the lull in activity. And now we have some massive 20,000 foot ash emissions and more activity. But over, overall in general, over the last five days, the seismic tremor is on a straight down path with some spikes. So it appears as if it's coming to an end here. Um, we have some more uh, enhanced seismicity on that 24 hour cycle pattern yesterday and then again today. And we have some of those larger quakes kicking off most recently. So we're gonna keep a close eye on the volcano as it continues to spew lava and make its way towards the sea. It will destroy more structures and cause more evacuations. That's just inevitable. Um, let's just move this up forward to the most current view and see what it looks like 
Uh, I'll leave you links to the seismic tremor. This is the most important thing you can be following if you don't want to watch a live stream. If you see a spike in here, then you'd want to come over and look at the live stream to see what's going on. A drop down or a, a spike up would be a change in activity. Also important to follow these quakes with depth. The fact that there's large quakes happening from 10 to 15 kilometers probably means that there is still lava being emplaced at depth, which is erupting at the surface, which means this could last for several more weeks. Um, and there, at any time, uh, the activity here could change and we'll bring you up to date information as it happens. Now here you can see the lava fountaining has increased quite substantially. Right there was uh, some lava fountaining to over a thousand feet or more. And so the activity is um, quite enhanced today. There should be lots of lava front movement towards the ocean. Might even be uh, half the distance to the ocean today alone. This is a large amount of output of active lava flowing down the mountain rapidly. And there's your update. Hope you got something out of the video. We do our best to bring you up-to-date information to keep you current with what's happening on La Palma and to end the fear with facts, and that's a boom to knowledge. Proper fire planning prevents piss poor performance. In a dystopian world where headlines are copied, talking points are repeated ad nauseum for views and money. We do it because we love you, and that's a boom. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't. Share this with like-minded people. Be safe. We love you. Hey, no, 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 no.